So earlier this year, I played a game called Thief, and it did extremely well. Square Enix really enjoyed the video and everything, and so they wanted to hook me up with this early. Uh, so Murdered Soul Suspect, I can play it up to a certain point before it actually comes out. And uh, if the video does well, I don't expect it to do half of what Thief did, but if it does, that would be amazing. Uh, but they're helping me with a, a four-game giveaway with this game. So, any console preference, just leave a comment below. And when the game finally does come out, I can continue the series. And I'll be doing the giveaway. So, much love to all of you. Let's do this. It's going to be a fun game. A serial killer is terrorizing the normally sleepy this streets of Salem. This crude drawing of a bell has been left at the scene of several murders Leading over the past few weeks. police to refer to the murderer weeks. as the Bell Killer. We spoke with a public relations officer. Authorities are asking anyone with any leads to contact this the SPD's anonymous tip line. This picture of a bell, the calling part the police have yet to attach any meaning or significance to, has become to synonymous and with no the hysteria surrounding his murders. You're saying there are no leads? No leads at all? grow up on the streets, you start thinking you're invincible. Nothing can touch you. You never really lose. Go to arrest some freak, find out you aren't as invincible as you thought. What kind of name is Ronan? That kid stole my wallet! Time to make it official. Ah, it hurts! You steal my car, you pay the price! Ah. Under arrest for the assault and battery, Vincent Coulter. Guilty on two counts of grand theft auto. On the indictment of burglary. Grand larceny and assault with a deadly weapon. <laughs> Let me take it. <laughs> I can't have my sister marrying some bum, right? They do. Oh, yeah, I do. No. No, Julian. Stay with me, you hear me? Julia. No, stay with me! Stay with me! Your family wore felonies like badges of honor. Now you think this new badge covers all that up? You're a fucking criminal. You need to slow down, man. All right? This is crazy. I didn't know better. So you actually want to die. Turn around. You're under arrest. So, so far this game reminds me of Heavy Rain meets <sighs> Alan Wake meets I don't know what. A whole new element. So basically you you're used to be, I guess, a criminal. You got married. The woman's brother was a cop. And they wanted to kind of straighten you out. So now you're your own detective. And I guess you don't know when to quit. That's the whole moral of the story. No, nah, ain't even moving. It's stuck. Oh, shit! Oh. Watch it, oh, lady! God. Plot twist, that's the killer! No. No. No, no, no! Oh. 
This is some Twilight Zone stuff, guys. I don't know what's going on. Reach for your face. Oh, yeah. That's a good objective. You gotta touch thy lips. Nothing. I'm still alive. I can fix it. If I just get back in my body, then maybe, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll wake up. This is... Oh, the, I'm actually controlling it. What? Oh, get it in there! Come on! I'm not... I wasn't born to play games like this. Here we go. You know what I think is weird? It also kind of has a... I don't know, it's, it's a very sci-fi kind of game. Come on. Someone had to hear that glass shatter. The guy from Thief. No. Come on. Wow, this actually, I'm gonna be perfectly honest, it's really smooth right now. I don't know if this is 60 frames or not. Mm -hmm. I know YouTube can only handle 30. This feels really smooth. So far, the graphics, gameplay, story is really intriguing too, so. No complaints Bro. here yet. I can't believe it. I can't believe I found you. Oh my god. Julia. I thought I'd never see you again. You look good. <laughs> I look better. God, I've missed you. I would give anything to be there with you. For us to be together again, but... But what? No. Oh, no, no, not again. Not you. If you're not here, where are you? It's the other side of the bridge. Bridge? What, what bridge? Where you are is a prison, or a bridge. It all depends on how you see it. Either way, where you are isn't safe. Do you hear me? We need to get you across the bridge. You need to move on. Move on? Is that where you are? Don't worry about me. Something about your life isn't finished yet. We don't have much time. Think. What about your life feels unresolved? I don't know. To figure that out. Now go. No. Julia, you left me once and it destroyed me. Please, please don't leave me again. We'll see each other again, love. Just save yourself. No, no, no Julia! Don't leave me, Julia! Damn it! Hello? There's a man in the street outside the Regal Apartments bleeding. He's been shot. Send an ambulance. He's not breathing. My friend says he's not breathing. I can't feel a pulse. There's broken glass everywhere and a lot of oh, blood. Man. This is bad. Yeah, I'll stay on the line until help arrives. Hey, man. Can you hear me? I like the voice actor for the main character, too. I like his voice, at least. Lady, please! Damn it. Uh, 
Hey, you. Hey, can you hear me? Come back. Head towards the light. So I'm not really sure how much of this game I can show you, but I do know if the videos do well, I can continue to show you more and more as the game comes out. Okay, so you can pass through certain objects. What about, like... Let's see, yeah. I guess all the extra stuff you can pass through. I guess if it's lit... If, yeah, if it's lit white, I don't think you can. We'll have to find out. I'm not sure who this girl is. I guess you're technically his soul and you're just trying to find the bell killer. Which is a pretty interesting uh, premise. I guess this is like a technically a tutorial on how to pass through. Yeah, okay. I was like, what? Hey, why did you run? It gets old. Giving counsel to the new ones. Don't take it personal. Running through walls, making things appear. You, you look like you've been here a while. You must know how this place works then. <laughs> works? This place isn't hard to understand. Figure out your gifts, and maybe you won't get trapped here. Okay, so you... I, I don't know. I, I guess since the start of this game is so dialogue-oriented... What do you want to know? Let me just go down the list. What do you mean, gifts? Your strengths in life are stronger in death. They become powers here. Some power is unique, some common. Possession, influencing people, manipulating the more fragile of ghostly objects to appear or disappear. Strengths become abilities. Huh. Who are you? Looks like you've been here a while. Me? I'm just someone like you. But hear me when I say this is no playground. You can rob yourself of your future, or others can do it for you. Okay, so I don't know if it really matters. I've heard there's just one ending, but I'm not 100% sure. So I'm going to keep asking all the questions I can. The door just hit me, but I'm passing through other stuff. What is it with this place? I thought I'd be able to walk through everything. We can't enter the buildings the people of Salem have consecrated. Save through an opening. An open drawer, or a window. But once inside, walls and doors hold no power over us. You'll know the ghostly objects we can't pass through by their blue glow. It will all seem logical in due time. Okay, how could I rob my own future? What? No, I, I, I'm sorry, I, I don't understand what you're talking about. How could I rob my own future? You're here to resolve something. You don't resolve it, you don't leave. Don't worry, that's pretty common. Common? That's crazy. Okay, who are those others? Or who are these others? What do you mean, others can steal my future? Demons. They were once like us, but lost themselves. They can never move on now. And exist only to consume those lingering here. Those like us. I getcha. Okay, so we look at different clues, demon threats. All clues discovered during investigations are logged here. Okay. If I'm not careful, a demon can consume me. Alright. So, I need to figure out who killed me and stop him. That's the way I can get out of here. Well, best of luck to you. Wait, 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 wait. There's more I need to know. Holy shit. Be careful out there. You never know what's waiting around the corner. Weird. You know, I'm actually kind of curious how this game's gonna wind up, because I don't know, I mean, even if you did find the killer, how do you... You're still a soul, you know? The guy who gunned me down in cold blood, is he my unfinished business? Pretty sure he is at this point. 
Return to the scene of my own... Oh yeah, the murder. You know, so far the game controls with us, got pretty smooth gameplay, and the story is really intriguing, so... I don't know, like, I'm hoping I can turn this into a full series for you guys. I know I can only go to up to a certain point in our town. Let's do this. Seeing your own body lying on the street. It's like looking in a mirror you don't want to see but can't turn away from. And that's when you realize you no longer know which one's real and which is the reflection. <sighs> yeah, great idea, Baxter. Tamper with the evidence. Backup. Who needs backup? <laughs> you shouldn't have tried to be one of us. <laughs> Man, you were one dumb son of a bitch. <clears throat> Sir? Hey, 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 Baxter, hey! Hey, just get back to taking them statements. Yeah, I'm the stupid one. Look, this is not your scene, Lieutenant. Just pay your specs and move on, please. Yeah, maybe it's not my scene, but it is my case. Tomorrow it'll be my case, and the next day, until we catch him. You do well to remember that, Sergeant. Look, I'm just following Captain's orders here. You know the procedure when a family member is... Yeah, well... Take all the time you need, LT. I lost count of the times I wished you were dead. Do me a favor, con man. Tell Julie I miss her. She knows, Rex. She knows. I need to find my killer's trail before it goes cold. Okay, find the killer's trail. I need to investigate everything I can to see if I can learn anything new. Start an investigation. Need to get my eyes Let's do on this. Stewart's notepad. See what they've learned. So did you did you see the man in the hood? Yes. I saw him. He killed that man in the street. I see. Look at all these people. He's got family. It'd be nice to know what they're talking about. I gotta see if they found any leads that I don't already know about. Okay, to solve an investigation, you must uh, first search for clues by inspecting suspicious objects and interacting with relevant people. By using the possess ability. All right, all right then. <laughs> Let's do this, guys. Clues here have got to tell me something. So we got to. I guess you inspect all the different clues or whatever, and then you can inspect people's minds. I guess I'm not really sure how it actually works. We're all learning as one big process, so. By little cones, overkill. Yeah, no shit, he shot him. How many bullets are on my back? He shot me seven times. I was, I'd already been thrown out of a window by the guy from Thief, it looked like. I'm sure it was that old woman with the hair curlers in her hair. That'd be crazy if it was, right? I like how he threw his invisible cigarette at that other cop. I right, was possessed people. Mind read, pe let's just peek. I guess you just can't. Stay calm. People need the cops to be calm now. Oh, you can jump from person to person. What? Glad I'm not a cop. Okay, so right now this we're just, just so reading people's minds. 
I like how you don't even have to really do anything other than just jump from person to person. Can't wait till I get assigned to lost. I could never do what she does. All right, let's walk over here. I will say that so far it also reminds me of Indigo Prophecy. I'm not sure if you guys have ever played that game. This whole thing is just weird. All of us cops just getting nowhere. All right, guys, so we're still investigating. Uh, you can't do certain things. Like, I couldn't get anything. She can actually be influenced, but I don't have enough evidence, so I gotta find more clues. So I'm gonna just go to the other cops and see what happens. What a night, huh, Robinson? Yeah. Crazy. Ronan, unbelievable. I don't get it. What was he even doing here? Asking for it. A witness called in saying he saw the bell killer into their building. Ronan responds, disregards orders for backup. <laughs> Next thing you know, the bell killer tried to see if he could make him sprout angel wings. And then, bam, 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 bam. You really, Seven to the chest. You really, point blank. You really have no idea when to quit, do you, Baxter? <laughs> you ever take a look at those tattoos of his? All that gangland prison crap? He was more criminal than cop. Yeah, you live like a thief, you die like a thief. He was still a badge, dickhead. All right, so we're kind of, you know what? We got the bell kiss. That's, an, that's another clue. I uh, will just jump around. Derek, you don't really need to do anything with these two anymore, so. Uh, your ability to correctly influence a person is dependent on the clues you find in investigation. All right, maybe I can influence her now. Let's see what happens. Oh, wow. Okay, so <laughs> originally I actually ran through here and selected all these and nothing happened and I was kind of confused, but I guess this is a thing. Let's try this one. Yeah. Yeah, I saw it. That man in the hood. Outside. Uh, looking up at, at the top apartment on the fourth floor, I think. So we almost have all eight clues. Let's look at the information. A witness thinks the killer was headed to the top floor of the apartment. Okay, so we need one more clue. Have I checked him yet? Peeking through the eyes of the living allows you to further your investigation by selecting the most relevant information you find. Alright, what did he find out about my killer? Only weapons found at the scene belong to me. That is correct. Uh, I don't know about the other two. She's missing. I'm gonna guess this one because that's the only one that really... Yeah, I'm gonna guess this one. Did I get it? Oh, I did. That's eight clues. Nice. My killer came here for a reason. The apartment up there must have some clues. So that's my way in, and it's closed. Fantastic. Well, here's my chance. I just need to follow Stuart into the building. So I guess you can't go through certain buildings. Let me see if I can. Can I talk? Yeah, hey, I can talk to her. Me. Do I need to wait for someone to open a door every time I want to go inside? Yeah, any buildings that were consecrated can be a bit tricky getting into, but once you're inside, it's smooth sailing. Same goes for getting out. Open doors, windows, whatever. It's all fair game. How many buildings are like this? Around here? Pretty much all of them. Don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. Thanks. All right, so I can finally enter the building. So I wanted to say before we go any further, uh, I'm gonna say, I guess after I enter here, I'll end the video, but thank you so much for all support. If this does well, you can expect more. And who knows, it might even let me post more, we'll see. Hmm. Hey, Sarge, 1019, please return to the scene. 10-4. 